The book, L'Aplatissement du Monde, or in English, The Flattening of the World, is about how the extension of uh, uh, freedom, individual freedom since the 60s, on political level or uh, uh, sexual level, for instance, led, in fact, to an extension of normative systems of do and don't. We have an extension of laws and regulations concerning the social life, for instance, the workplace, but also concerning the intimate, uh, for instance, sexuality. For me, this call for a systematic extension of do and don't is a consequence of a crisis of the implicit. That is a consequence of what I call the crisis of culture, something which is shared without being explicit. I wrote this book because I wanted to show that the increasing use of the concept of identity in politics, but both on the left and on the right, is a failed answer to a more general crisis of culture. Identities are now defined by a limited set of traits, like race, gender preferences, eating habits, that don't really create a society, but are just, you know, setting up subcultures these subcultures are looking for safe spaces. For instance, on the left, uh, university campuses, uh, but on the right, gated communities or national borders. The crisis of culture, that is the loss of a shared um, implicit, and the extension of the normative uh, systems are a consequence of a more general crisis of the social link which is um, uh, namely the uberization of the economy, the individualization of social practices. We should work at restoring the social link at the grassroots level or at the level of uh, citizenship, instead of building affinity communities on the virtual world of Internet.